Minecraft Bingo 2.4 is now available. In this version, in addition to being able to generate randomized bingo cards, you can now specify a numeric seed which selects a particular bingo card and spawn point. Minecraft Bingo is a vanilla survival scavenger hunt minigame. The game begins just like normal Minecraft, where you punch trees and make tools to gear up. But the goal of the game is to gain certain items pictured on your bingo card. Items that you can obtain via crafting, smelting, and through mob drops. Try to get five items in a row, column, or diagonal in order to win. The customized terrain of this Minecraft world features both tiny biomes and many dungeons in order to make the gameplay fast and fun. Go for the fastest time to get five in a row, or for extra challenge, try to get all 25 items on your bingo card. The new Seeded mode allows you to type in a seed number, which is used to specify both a bingo card and a particular world spawn. As a result, you and a friend can each type in the same seed number and then compete against each other for the fastest time on equal footing. In the near future, I'll be posting weekly challenge seeds so that you can play the same bingo cards as lots of others and everyone can compare scores. And for the true speedrunners in the group, you may enjoy replaying the same seed over and over again, trying to learn the terrain and the bingo card to get your new personal best or even world records on a particular seed. I'll suggest some of these challenges as well. Want to play the map yourself? The download link to get Minecraft Bingo 2.4 is in the video description. Minecraft Bingo 2.4 requires no mods. It just requires Minecraft 1.8 on the PC. Minecraft Bingo was built entirely in creative mode by me, Dr. Brian Lorgon 111, by hand. I was placing blocks and typing in commands. If, after playing the game, you decide you really love it, feel free to donate. There's a donation link to me in the description. In this video, I've only talked about the new feature of Minecraft Bingo 2.4, the seeded game mode. However, the other game modes still exist, which allow multiple players to play on a couple of teams against one another, including the highly interactive and intense lockout mode. Check a previous video for a description of that game mode.